Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyana Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam amma ba'd ayyul ahabbat fillah continuing on in our study of the difference between advising and condemning by Imam Al-Hafid Ibn Rajib rahmatul alayhi rahmatul wasi'ah the Imam was speaking about the importance of understanding and distinguishing between condemning someone and offering advice. And this advice, of course, can be to that individual or advice to the ummah to beware and be cautious of the people of desires and bid'ah. Khatib al Baghdadi, he said, Laysa ibanatul ulama li ahwala ruat ghiba. بَلْ هِيَ النَّصِيحَةَ وَلَهُمْ فِي إِذْحَارِهَا أَعْظَمْ مَثُوبًا لِكَوْنِهَا مِمَّا يَجِبُ عَلَيْهِمْ كَشْفُهُ وَلَا يَسْعَهُمْ إِخْفَعُهُ وَسَتَرُهُ Imam al-Khatib al-Baghdadi Rahmatullah alayhi He said It is not uh, from backbiting that the ulama clarify the condition of the narrators talking about ahla hadith and the narrators of hadith he said rather it is nasiha it is advice and for them for clarifying it and making these things known is an immense reward because they are fulfilling what is an obligation upon them to expose. And it is not permissible for them to cover or hide his faults, meaning the person they're criticizing from the Ruat, because that was defending the religion. Likewise is the case, although we're not talking about narrators, it's still a defense of the religion when you have to criticize someone for their bid'ah or mistakes or refuting their mistakes in order to prevent those mistakes from being spread and from people to fall into those mistakes thinking that, hey, so-and-so is a person of knowledge, I think I will follow them. But rather, the role of the people of knowledge is to expose or to uncover and make clear and clarify the mistakes that are being made, regardless of whether it's from Ahl Sunnah or Ahl Bid'ah. And as we mentioned before, that the case of Ahl Bid'ah is different than the case of Ahl Sunnah when it comes to making mistakes or falling into a Bid'ah or what have you, is that when regarding criticizing an individual from Ahl Sunnah, you maintain their honor and respect. So you're not there trying to bring them down and you try, you attempt, you maintain their their uh, their position and status, while at the same time warning from the mistake that they fell in and correcting them. But the person of innovation and desires, of course, you don't have that same main uh, attempt to maintain their respect and their position, because in fact you want their guidance or for them to be exposed and away from the position of Dao and calling people to misguidance and bid'ah. وَقَالَ إِبْنَ رَجِبْ أَحْلَ بِدْعَ وَالْضَلَالِ وَمَنْ تَشَبَهَ بِالْعُلَمَاءِ وَلَيْسَ مِنْهُمْ يَجُوزْ بَيَانْ جَهْلِهِمْ وَإِذْهَارْ عُيُوبِهِمْ تَحْذِيرٍ مِنْ اِقْتِدَى بِهِمْ a beautiful narration of Imam Ibn Rajib or a statement of his, which is in this book, but this is the original Arabic statement. Ibn Rajib said, the people of innovation and misguidance and those who resemble scholars, but they are not from them, meaning they're not real scholars. 
it is permissible to clarify their ignorance. To clarify, meaning to expose their ignorance. And to openly discuss or make their mistakes and shortcomings known in relation or for the purpose of warning and preventing others from following them in those mistakes. وَسُئِلَ الشَّيْخِ صَالِ بِنْ فُوزَانِ حَفَظَ اللَّهِ تَعَالَى هَلْ بَيَانْ بَعْدَ الْأَخْطَاءِ الْكُتُبِ الْحِزْبِيَةِ أَوْ جَمَاعَةِ الْوَافِدَةِ إلَى بِلَادِنَا يَعْتَبِرُ مِنْ تَعَارُضِ الْدُعَاءِ فَأَجَابْ so the Sheikh Salih bin Fuzan, Hafid Allah Ta'ala, was asked, uh, is it considered exposing the callers, meaning those who propagate Islam, by mentioning the mistakes in the books of the people of Hizbiyah, I mean the people who call the partisanship and groups, or the jama'at, those foreign uh, groups. To uh, that are in our country, uh, is this considered exposing the the callers to Islam? And then the Sheikh responded. He said, "La, have a min ta'arul This is not from. He said, "No, this is not from." Exposing the du'at. لَأَنَّ هَذَهِ الْكُتُبِ لَيْسَتْ كُتُبُ الدَّعْوَى كُتُبُ الدَّعْوَى وَهَوَ لَا يَسْحَابَ هَذَهِ الْكُتُبِ وَالْأَفْكَارِ لَيْسُ مِنْ دُعَاتِ إِلَى اللَّهِ عَلَى بَصِيرَةِ وَعِلْمْ وَعَلَى حَقِّ So he said, no, this is not from exposing the callers. Because these books... They are not from the books of Dawa. Those people, those people who make, uh, who write these books and have these uh, ideologies, they are not from the du'at, meaning the, those callers to Allah, who are on basira, <coughs> having insight and knowledge and being on the truth. Then he said, Hafidullah Ta'ala, he said, فَنَحْنُ هِينْ نُبَيَنْ أَخْتَى هَذِهِ الْكُتُبْ أَوْحَوْا اللَّهِ دُعَاتْ لَيْسَ مِنْ بَابَ تَجْرِي لِلَشْخَاصِ لِذَاتِهِمْ لِذَاتِهِمْ وَإِنَّمَ مِنْ بَابَ نَصِيحَ لِلْأُمَّةِ أَنْ تَصَرَّبُوا إِلَيْهَا أَفْكَارْ مَشْبُوهَا ثُمَّ تَكُونَ الْفِئْنَ وتتفرق الكلمة وتشتتت الجماعة وليس غردنا الأشخاص غردنا الأفكار الموجودة بالكتب التي وفدت إلينا باسم الدعوة The Sheikh responded very beautifully. He said, Then, so then, in the situation where we clarify the mistakes that are contained in those books or with those callers, this is not in the uh, from the manner of criticizing people in and of themselves, meaning just, just, just for the sake of criticizing them. But verily, this is from nasiha, advice for the ummah. So that their suspicious ideologies will not leak or will not be spread amongst the people and then become fitna and divide the unified cause or kalima and break apart the jama'ah, the main body of Muslims. And it is not our intention the person, the individual. Rather, our intention is, is their ideology, 
which is contained in those books, which is brought to us in the name of Dawah, letting us know that we should be just, our intention should be for the sake of Allah, to keep from spreading harmful ideas. Many people, they ask me, why do I speak? Why have I spoken? It's not that I spend my time and energy speaking about Yasser Qadi or Nu'man or anyone. But in fact, from one video or possibly a couple of little videos in which I spoken about things which were mistakes that they made. And it was necessary because of the those ideas that they were speaking about have become widespread in which the people belittle 